Hey guys, I'm here with Abraham Padron. Abraham, what do we got going on today? Hey Arnold, how's it going Arnold? All right. Great, All right. Great, thing to come out Arnold. Yes, sir. We went out here is we have a professional uh, building here, business building, that we have a space here for lease. Okay, great. Uh, we are located at 2303 Ed Carey Drive here in Harlingen, Texas. We are right across the street from Valley Baptist, as you can see. Valley Baptist Hospital, got Ed it. Carey Drive. That is correct. Do you have plenty of park uh, parking? Of par Absolutely, we have plenty of parking space. Great. But we have this building that we have that's been recently remodeled. Let's go inside. Yes, come on in. It's uh, 3,000 square feet. Okay. It's, uh, it was built back in 2003, and it was built by yours truly. All right. So I know the building well. Perfect. As you can see, when you walk in here, this is the the, the reception area. This, uh, when we first built this building, this was actually a uh, uh, an insurance office. Uh, for a few years, then uh, the last several years, it's been a real estate office. Okay. Uh, it's set up for for business. However, that being said, it's also set up. It can be used as a doctor's offices. All right, show we me have around. Different offices. We have, we have three thousand square feet. We have on the right side. We have four offices on this side plus the, the break room. Okay. On the left side, we have three offices plus a large office it could be the the boss's office, I guess you could call it. Okay. Uh, and I'll show you. I'll take it real quick. All uh, right. In the middle, we do have a a conference room. This is a built-in uh, counter, as you can see, that was built. Um, it's here. Uh, can we move it? Possibly, however, it seems to be a good reception area. This is, let's start with this first office. This first office is an office that has actually, as you, that, that has locks in it, can be a, a private office. Now, if you look at the floors, you don't see a carpet, you don't see any tile. Because if you decide to rent it, we will basically put tile or, or, or definitely any, the surface that you will. So what you're rent. trying to say is you'll work with anybody. Absolutely, absolutely. Perfect. Come this way. This is another office that we have. It's a smaller office now. This can be used, it's been used uh, when it was uh, in insurance, it was used by individual agents. When it was in real estate, it was used by the real estate agents. So it's, it's, a, it's an office. Now the roughing in every one of these offices has roughing in the middle that's covered at this time, but it's roughing for water and, 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 and drainage in case a doctor would wanna, would wanna lease it. So you're saying that every single office has the that ability to have some water that in That is correct. To have a sink, to have a, a I guess, the examination room. Well, examination okay. room. Uh, we have another one. This one here is a little bit more open. This used to be more because it was open. It doesn't have, it's not as private. It used to be more for the assistance. Got it. Correct? Got if it. you look to, the, to, to, your, to your right here, this is a larger room with two doors. This has been served as a conference room in the past. Okay. Okay. Very good. You, you can see a lot of these, uh, these, these have uh, glass. It's all glass. And it was uh, custom made along with some of the designs that we put on there. This is another private office that we have as well. So uh, once again, private office with this lock in case anybody needs privacy. So um, that, that concludes these uh, four offices that we have in this side. Then if we go to the very back, in the back we have a, uh, a break room. And as you can see, this break room uh, has the ability to have a refrigerator. It, this, a is, this, is ex this is actually a very good sized break room. Correct. It, it really we is. also have, if you want to go this, look this way, this way we also have a storage facility. So many, of, many people that have, uh, that deal mainly, maybe they deal with a lot of paperwork or maybe they have a lot of uh, IT stuff they need to install. We have the board, we have everything set up. So you can go ahead and install any of your IT here on, on this board um, as, as well. Perfect. Okay. So come on this way. Let's go back up here. And um, as you walk down this hall, these halls were extra large. And the reason they were is it's, uh, we like them that way so they're not too small. So you can actually fit uh, a wheelchair. You can different things like that. I believe they're somewhere close to six feet. Uh, you have different, you have uh, women's bathroom. As you can see, we have tile all the way to the top, and as well as a men's bathroom on the other side, which we missed, but nonetheless, it also is. We also have a utility room. Every one of these, as you can see, every utility room, every one of these doors are solid, solid doors. Perfect. Okay. Um, if you come this way, let's, let's go into the boss's, the boss's office. This would be the boss's office. It's a bit larger. Now, this one, not only does it have some cabinets in here that, that you can actually set up for a television set up as well, but if you, it has its own personal bathroom. Oh, wow. So you have your own personal bathroom if you want to make it this way. 
uh, has a personal bathroom with its own personal shower. Oh my God! Can, so I, can those, I can I just move in right now? That's it. That's it. If you want to move in, you can you can work. You can basically live here, I guess, right? You can work and <laughs> and work and 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 I will. Work out. Okay, full disclosure, I actually lived here for three days during Hurricane Dolly. Oh, you are right. You are correct. Yeah. I remember those days. <laughs> Back in those days. This is another another office that's, uh, again, once again, doesn't have a door. It's more for an assistant office. Same size. We have another office here that's a, that's a private office, as you can see. Perfect. And there lastly, is. we make it out here, and we have uh, an office here that's also a private office, similar to the one that we saw at the beginning of the, of the video. Okay, very good. Now, okay. Abraham, so what we're trying to do here is obviously we're trying to get more people to look at this building, and you, you said, like you said before, you had an insurance company here at one point, you had a, a major real estate company here at one point. Correct. So at this point, what we're looking for is a new tenant. Now, are you willing to work with people, and as far as, you know, price etc absolutely absolutely yes uh, you know the going rate right now many people want to lease your building and they want to make it triple net uh, they'll charge your price and then they'll say well yeah but that's uh, that's triple net and for those of you that know don't know what triple net is is that means that you have to include taxes uh, uh, taxes maintenance and and uh, what's the last one I'm forgetting sure. and insurance yes well our lease our price is gonna include the triple net oh so it's once, gonna be all inclusive so, ex exactly so once you pay for this you have to worry, yes, absolutely. You have to worry about your own water. You have your own water meter and you have your own light, uh, light meter, electricity meter, but you're not gonna have to worry about the, the insurance for the building. You're not gonna have to worry about the maintenance and you're not gonna have to worry about the taxes. And my, it's my understanding you have you have several real estate holdings uh, all over the valley. That is correct. And so you obviously are an experienced landlord so would any possible tenant have any type of issues for, with, working well, with you? Well, I'll tell you what, I, I, I hope not. I, like I tell most, all my tenants, uh, I tell them, I said, nobody loves their properties more than I do. Uh, so I have my own, my own maintenance uh, crew that go out and maintain the buildings on a regular basis. So we maintain your building as well as we maintain the landscaping, um, the, the, the look of the, of the building. As you can see, this building, after the last tenant left, we came in here and we redid the whole thing as far as uh, painted it, knocked down some things that the, that the last tenant had put up, some walls and stuff, removed some of the carpets because it was old carpet. And we are prepared to uh, hopefully do some, um, some changes for the, the new tenant that comes in. Perfect. One last question, uh, Abraham. If someone is interested, who do, who do you want them to call? Absolutely. They need to call uh, Arnold Sellis uh, Realty. And they can just Google that. And they can Google that, yes, or, or your number. I don't want to give them your, I don't know if you can give your personal number, but surely you can. Sure, I'll give them my number, 956-507-0073. Again, that's 956-507-0073. Abraham, appreciate your time. Let's see if we can get you. this done for you. Have a great, great. day. Thanks, Arnold.